Hi everyone, I am Anonymous Traveler. For today's music review, I am going to talk about an album of a surreal and unearthly atmosphere. But first, forget about everything you know about the term black matter. I know a lot of people turned off by black matter due to their satanic lyrics or grotesque corpse painting or harsh screaming vocal or terrible sound quality that seems like recorded in your mom's basement with the 1980s ancient cassette tape recorder. However, there are some serious musicians who incorporated the harsh and noisy element of black matter and created something entirely unique on its own. Also, regarding satanic lyrics and uh, satanism, it is true that majority of black metal band write about it, but there are some band dealing with an entirely different subject. Some dealing with nature, or Viking mythology, or Egyptian mythology, or the universe itself, etc., etc. And this band, Blood Earth Nord, is certainly the latter. So, if you cannot stand lyrics about Satan or the God of Mendes, etc., don't worry because you are not going to find anything like that in this album. This music is atmospheric, introspective, black matter with cosmic and the avant-garde leanings. Every genre of music has a few elite or adventurers who push it the boundary of the limited genre characteristics or musical grammar. They are the cream of the crop and sometimes they create something truly unique. And this album, Dialogue with the Stars, by Blood Owls Nod is definitely one of those special albums. The full title of the album is Memoria Vetusta 2 Dialogue with the Stars because this is the second part of the trilogy series Memoria Vetusta. Blood Owls Nod started off in France as a somewhat average black metal band. For the first few years, they played black metal with better than average quality, but at the time, experimental nature of their later work had not been developed yet. However, from 2003 album, The Work Which Transforms God, they began to use avant-garde element with their black metal sound. In a way, it started avant-garde underground extreme metal movement. And as, as a king of avant-garde atmospheric black metal, Blood Owls Nod created several great albums. Among them, I chose 2009 album, Memoria Betustia 2, Dialogue with the Stars. This is introspective avant-garde black matter with strong spiritual and cosmic leanings. And through the whirlwind of harsh sound, the occasional melody line comes off as somewhat dreamy and the occasional reverb-driven leads, adding the surreal and unearthly atmosphere. This music can induce dreamlike state, even with its noisy sound. This is not typical blank matter. Actually, it is not typical commercial music at all. This is very abstract music, that definitely deviated from the musical norm or preset musical grammar of popular music. Also, 
This album has some of very brilliant interpretation of meditation technique taught by the Buddha. From the song titles, you can see the references such as Sutta Anapanisati, Vipassana, The Formless Spear, etc. You can also say that this album is a story of a meditator's journey from the earthly realm to the higher realm or the higher state of mind space. Blood Earth Nord created several other excellent albums, but if you want to give it a try, I would recommend this album. I'm attaching the link to the album down below. Thanks for listening and all the best.